All right, so rating these squads again, lads. This is Techers. Techers, let me see if I can zoom in. But yeah, you've got Ronaldo, Messi, Ronaldinho. Lampard and me just don't get on, so I would definitely look to upgrade that. Um, I would say that Spangley has got a better choice with Nakunku there uh, in his squad. Skriniar, I'm not too sure on Skriniar at right at full back or at CB, um, but I do like the attacking options of the four two one three long ball counter. Uh, Techers, I would say if you're playing this uh, as a quick counter, you're playing a two at the back basically with quick counter. I mean, you're going to be having to outscore all your opponents because you will concede goals. Trust me, you will concede goals. I know you're good at the game. Uh, Spangley is going to be the same playing long ball counter. That guy. Has got Dennis Law up front, Nakunku. Why are the pictures so small, lads? Salah, Mbappe, Robertson, uh, Timber, Skriniar again, pretty decent. I would probably say to get somebody in instead of Mbappe. That is something that I repeat all the time. Um, you know, I mean, like, <laughs> Terra, I get, yeah, I get what you're saying, man, with Lampard. I, I never got on with Lampard. And it's the same what I'd say about Mbappe, right? Mbappe is the type of player that I just never, ever, ever got on with. Like, ever. That's not to say that he's not a beast. He's not a beast player. Um, I can't really see this squad, lads. Apologies for that. Uh, came first on the weekend showdown with this squad. Again, yeah, you've got your quick counter. Carlos at the back. Shua Mene, Rijkaard, and Nakunku. You'll see a big um, You'll see a big trend with Nakunku at, at AMF, lads. You'll see a big trend with him there. He's so good. Uh, Jay Bean, I'm pretty new. Any advice is welcome. Well, if you're playing a three at the back, I think I already reviewed this squad, man. As far as I know, I already reviewed this squad. So make sure you check out an episode of that. Um, we also have this one. So this is what I would consider a squad that could do with a little bit of help and review, right? So this is kind of what more this series is probably about. There's no point personally having Kostic in that as a left winger if you're playing long ball counter because you have Mbappe as your target man, right? I would not play a cross and center forward or a cross and left or right winger, unless you have somebody that can actually you play to, right? Now, I know you're saying that you have Lahavich there and you've him highlighted, that's fine, but I definitely wouldn't play him. What I would do with this squad, if it was me, is I would switch to a two-man up front, I'd take out Kostic altogether, and I would put Casemiro in here, Lorente as a right, Messi and Mbappe through the middle, and then I would probably bring on Vlahovic, whoever was on form, either Vlahovic or uh, Rafael Leao. That's who I would bring on as a target man. Mbappe is not going to score you many goals, man, in my opinion. Uh, Medi, we have another squad here as well. De Maria, Brahim Diaz. Again, I would probably play Marcus Llorente on the right flank so I could switch that. Oh, my connection just went down there, lads. So apologies about that. Um, but Mbappe, Abamyang, De Maria, Brahim Diaz, Llorente, all of these are good, man. Uh, all of these are good players, so I'm not too sure of my electricity, like something happened there, it was like lightning or something, two seconds lads, this squad here, Brahim Diaz, Marcus Lorente, you don't see that often, I would definitely put Lorente out here and put De Marie on the left side, the problem is again with this squad is you're not playing a target man, do you know what I mean, you're not playing a target man there, so that's something to keep an eye on, uh, let me see, we have a couple of more messages to go through here lads, any suggestions about maybe who's working my main squad? I mean, I don't have much advice on this because you have pretty much got a stacked squad, man. Do you know what I mean? Um, this one is just a traditional 4-5-1. I like this squad as well. I like this squad. Uh, it's a very decent squad. But again, like, with the way the game plays at the moment, lads, I would not be playing uh, Vinicius unless you're crossing in. If you are crossing in, that's fine. If you're not crossing in, um, then you need to have a target man in if you are crossing in. And I don't see any target man on the bench here. I don't see any target man here. But Davies, Marquinhos, Rijkaard, Koundé, pretty solid as well. I'd probably swatch, swap Koundé and Marquinhos, to be honest with you, because most attacks come through the middle. Trent, I like this card of Trent, but I probably wouldn't use him there because you're not going to have that like that box-to-box -box style. Or is he box-to-box? -box? Is that Trent box to box? I could be wrong. Uh, do uh, we've got Inzaghi big time, Zico big time, beautiful cards, Cafu, Carlos, very Brazilian inspired team. I mean, I don't need to say anything more on that, man. That's a very good squad. Any advice? No, no advice. If you can't win with that squad, it's not the squad. Um, let me see what else is here. 
we've got a 4-3-3, very similar to a squad that I played with for a while. Um, Shuamene, Declan Rice, Hernandez, Araujo. So you're basically playing four centre-backs as your back line. Mbappe, Romario, Messi. To be honest, look, maybe I need to change my mind on Mbappe. He just doesn't do it for me. And Nkunku in the middle. Yeah, I like that squad. Shuamene, I would probably swap out for Goretzka as a box-to-box, -box, but that's pretty much it. Um, Medi, you've already done it. Rivas, Rizos, that's just a middle true. I think that's a troll formation. You're definitely not playing that. Even though it works, I played that formation uh, last week on stream and I dominated with it. But yeah, I mean, I don't need to advise you on this squad, man, because of the players you have. Samuel, we've got a 4-3-3 up front as well. Um, Neymar, De Bruyne. A lot of people playing De Bruyne, but I would definitely swap out Nakunku and Neymar. So I'd probably swap out Mbappe or put Mbappe through the middle. If you have... If you're playing 4-3-3 up front and you're playing quick counter, I would definitely not use De Bruyne here. Definitely not. That's just, just my opinion. And I think it's the right opinion in this case.